Virtual reality lends itself really well to helicopter simulation because to control a helicopter you need to have good peripheral vision and you need to be able to look around and have a really good spatial and situational awareness. And virtual reality has been very good for that, but one of the limitations is that the students are unable to read the instruments and the gauges and that's, that's really difficult. So Vario is able to solve that problem. What that does is take our trainers from being a basic trainer that teaches a student how to hover through to a serious trainer that can be used for a whole range of training applications including navigational exercises, uh, emergency procedures and a whole bunch of things never thought possible before now. Traditionally simulators used in pilot training in the military involve large platforms, big domes, expensive projectors and lots of technicians and lots of support and what we've tried to do at Ryan Aerospace is uh, build a more simple device that takes up a smaller footprint, is more robust, doesn't need uh, a technician to run it and uh, operates in the virtual reality environment. So we're finding that in some cases for some of our customers they're able to reduce the helicopter training in the real helicopter by around 40 percent and at $2,800 an hour to run uh, this kind of helicopter the savings are huge and the potential is just going to continue to grow. We are working with one high profile customer right now and the testing that they are doing on our simulators is proving that a lot of the training that's traditionally done in the real helicopter can be done in the Helimod helicopter simulator and with virtual reality headsets such as the Vario we are talking savings potentially in the tens of millions of dollars.